Ladies and gentlemen, I have a question for you. Raise your hands if you've ever injured your knees while doing sports. Quite a bit. Looks like 40% of you have. That's quite a lot. Well, this guy has as well. But what you usually hurt are actually the ligaments of your knees. And if it's real bad that the ligaments are torn, you need to replace them with a new piece of ligament that you take from somewhere else in your body. That sounds very complicated. Why don't we just make a new piece of synthetic ligament, just like we would do with a teeth implant? Any idea? Well, the reality is we don't know how to make them. And it's really a question of material science. I'm not talking to you about doing something as difficult as a heart or a lung. No, no, it's really just a thread anchored on two bones and supposed to hold them together. Easy, right? Well, for us, in material science, we classify ligaments as hydrogels. So a water-swollen material, hence the hydro, and gel because it's a mixture of organic molecules. So we would need such a hydrogel that is biocompatible, but it's also as soft, stretchy and tough as a real ligament. But wait, what is the toughness of a material? Well, it is its ability to resist fracture, whether it breaks suddenly or not. And that's the topic of my thesis. My PhD is about the toughness of hydrogels. Back to the lab. I like to imagine myself a bit of a cook. I just try out a bunch of recipes. So I just take those organic molecules, I mix them with some water, pour them in a mold, quickly bake them, et voila, I have my piece of hydrogel. And then I do what any material scientist loves to do. I pull on it until, paf, it breaks. And that's exactly what you can see on the image on the right how the fracture went through my material. And I tried to better understand exactly what happened to be able to improve my recipe, such that next time I need to pull even further before my hydrogel breaks. And I hope, like this, that one day I will find the recipe of a hydrogel that is so tough that we can actually use it to make synthetic ligaments, and that we can all, even if you already injured your knees, Go back on the slopes and pull your craziest stunts as if nothing ever happened. Thank you. <laughs>